This is how you sanitize the seltzer hoses. First, lay the hoses out in the driveway. Then what you're going to do is you're going to have at the far end of the driveway, you have a little slope there. Uh, at the far end of the driveway, you're gonna have the male and the female end of a pair of hoses. The next pair, male and female end, and then uh, just male end where you're gonna have a cap on, on that one. The ends of those hoses are gonna get connected together so that the, um, uh, the solution, which is one tablespoon to two and a half gallons of water, that will be your solution for the sanitizing solution. So once the hoses are laid out, then you're going to have another person at the other end that's going to just continue to fill the hoses with, uh, with that solution. You can see as it fills up, put a cap on this end, then go on to the next one. As that one fills up, then you can take the cap off the other one, connect those two together, and both hoses are gonna have, uh, have the uh, sanitizing solution in them. Repeat the step for the, uh, for the next pair of hoses. And then the final hose at the other end is, um, the final hose at the other end is going to have a cap on it. And the shorter hose that you saw um, earlier, uh, this shorter hose, you can just loop it around and then just let that on a slope. The, the idea is to have all of the hoses filled with that solution and then let it sit for 12 hours and then rinse them thoroughly. Usually I connect them all together and um, just uh, run the water sprinkler for an hour or so and that will rinse them all out. There you go.